Thanks for joining us for this brief video tutorial on Notability for Artists. Wikipedia has Notability guidelines that determine which subjects deserve standalone articles. Of course, Notability is not an exact science, but is determined by a person or subject's importance within the field of focus. For the purposes of Wikipedia editing, a person is considered notable if they are regarded as an important figure or are widely cited by peers or successors, if they are known for originating a significant new concept, theory, or technique, if they have created or played a major role in co-creating a significant or well-known work that has been the subject of an independent book or feature-length film or of multiple independent periodical articles or reviews. Notability can also be determined by a person's work. If the work has become a significant monument, has been a substantial part of a significant exhibition, has won significant critical attention, or is represented within the permanent collections of several notable galleries or museums, then that person can be considered notable. In the lesson plan and description for this video, you will find notability guidelines for authors, editors, journalists, filmmakers, photographers, artists, architects, and other creative professionals. You should take some time to familiarize yourself with Wikipedia's notability guidelines before adding new articles to Wikipedia. This will help prevent you from getting in notability disagreements with other editors. It's also important to note that one of the major guidelines for notability is that the person's work is cited in reliable sources. Reliable source material must have been published, the definition of which, for our purposes, is made available to the public in some form. Unpublished materials are therefore not considered reliable. You should also be sure to use sources that directly support the material presented in an article and are appropriate to the claims made. If available, academic and peer-reviewed publications are usually the most reliable sources, but there are other sources that can be considered reliable as well. You should take some time to familiarize yourself with reliable source guidelines on Wikipedia before citing articles. You'll find some of this information on the lesson plan and in the video description. Thank you so much for taking the time to watch this video and please go on and be bold.